Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, it's like 5 a.m. right now. And I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me for school. I'm gonna be taking out my braids, eating breakfast, picking up my outfits. You guys know the drill. But I need to go bath right now, brush my teeth. In my skincare routine, you know all of that. So I'll be back in like, well, 20 minutes for me, two seconds for you guys. 20 minutes later. Okay, so I just got done um, washing my face, doing my skincare routine, brushing my teeth, putting on lotion, deodorant. Um, I even picked out my outfit. It's just this random shirt and some black and white shorts. You guys couldn't see that, but like, that's besides the point. I'm gonna start taking out my hair because that's the main focus of this video. It's currently 6.10. School starts at 7.15 and um, I'm trying to be done by them because I don't wanna be in school taking out my hair, you know? So this is how it's looking. So it's currently 6:18, and I'm about to start taking down my hair. Um, this process is really simple for me. I just take olive oil, put a little bit on my fingertips, put a little on my fingertips, rub it together, and then I start taking down the braid. Um, make sure to be really gentle because you don't want to mess up the curl pattern. You want to be in the video yeah. so my sister's about to go to work this is how she's looking she works at a dermatology office isn't she cute <laughs> look at her face hi jonah's vlog <laughs> okay so i just took out the first braid and the ends are looking a bit dusty but other than that she's looking cute one reason i like braid out so much is because they last longer like for a wash and go um i've never actually like did a successful one because they're just so hard the gel makes my hair shrink up so much like the gel and the water and like the whole process my hair is literally to my head like after i'm totally done with it so i don't do wash and goes i do twist outs but not as much because twist outs they don't last as long as braid outs do plus i feel like braid outs look better on my hair like the curl pattern it gives my hair i feel like it looks better my braid outs have come a long way like i remember my first braid out was the a for a dance when was that two years ago at this point yeah two years ago it was okay i guess the first day it didn't last more than a day i slept without a bonnet so that's our drill sleep with no bonnet your hair is gonna be messed up Second braid down. I don't know if you guys just saw what I did, but once you get far enough up to the top of the braid, you can like pull on the ends so like they'll completely come apart. I'll show you guys again in another second. Okay, that wasn't really that good that time. Um, chill. Anyway, so. Like that, you can just pull on the ends and it'll unravel to like the top. Let's see, it'll be on my head and it is roasting me up. I ain't no chicken.
gosh, get into it. Okay, so I just got done finishing my braids, and this is how the hair is looking like completely fresh out. I missed one. Oh. Okay, so this is how the hair is looking. Um, she's cute or whatever. The curl definition out of this world. So I'm gonna start separating starting at the back. I'm just lightly pulling apart the braid. I don't want to disturb the curls, so I'm going to focus on the roots instead of the ends. Even though the ends are bad and need to be chopped off, I still want them to look somewhat good. So I'm literally just taking it and spreading them out. And on the first day, I feel like my hair doesn't look the best because it's like flat and doesn't have that much volume. But on day two, I feel like it looks the best because it has the volume and the definition and then day three is just looking like looking a little eh bland So I kind of like how it's looking. So I'm gonna take my pick and I'm gonna start fluffing it out. I feel like this is the hardest part because I feel like when I do it myself, it doesn't look right, if that makes sense. Like picking at the roots, not the ends of my hair because we wanna preserve the curl there. I also pick to make sure my part in the back does not show. So like I'll pick in the middle, like I'll pick the two sides of my hair together so like they don't look separated. Okay, so I think I'm done with my hair. Let me show you guys in a better light. This is how my hair is looking. A little dusty in the front, but like what's new. But the curl definition, period. Period, period, period. If you want to see what I use on my hair to achieve this braid out, you should definitely check out my last video, my winter wash day routine. I basically talk about how I do my braid out and it'll be linked up here. I wish it had a little bit more volume. I normally don't expect volume until day two or three. Let me fluff out the back real quick because it's kind of like messed up. Okay, so I like that a little bit better. The main focus of this video, the main focus of this video was taking out my hair. But now that I'm done, what time is it? It's 7.08 and school starts at 7.15. So I have seven minutes before school starts. I'm about to go eat breakfast because I'm really hungry right now. So I have my pancake and sausage on a stick thingy. Okay, so school starts in approximately four minutes. So I'm about to stop filming this get ready with me because I want to pay attention in school. I have two weeks left. Yeah, I have two weeks left. I'm trying to finish strong. Hopefully all A's and B's, preferably all A's. I'm also ready to eat and I don't like eating on camera because I feel like I chew weird. This is the end of Vlogmas Day 7. Is this 7 Vlogmas Day 7? Wow. So we have 18 days left of Vlogmas. I'm so excited. I hope you guys are ready for more videos and vlogs and get ready with me's. That's pretty much it. Follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Peace out.